Hello guys, we are back with a brand new video. I'm Josh from Wondershare Demo Creator, and if you find our videos helpful and want us to continue making more great content, then don't forget to support us by hitting that subscribe button, and you can press that bell icon to never miss any updates from us. So that's out of the way now. Today, we're gonna talk about how to record streaming videos on Windows 10. I'm gonna cover three different methods so you never have to waste time thinking about what to do in case a method doesn't work. The first method you'll learn is recording a streaming video with Wondershare Demo Creator. Wondershare Demo Creator is the preferred choice of many professional content creators when it comes to recording streaming videos on Windows 10. It is an excellent option since it can record both the screen and the screen's audio, which are necessary if you need to record the sound as well. Wondershare Demo Creator is an easy to use software and offers a variety of features. You could not just capture recording, but also edit your videos using its video editor add narration to your videos, and upload them both to local storage and cloud storage. It's very, very easy to record streaming videos with Demo Creator. All you need to do is follow a simple three-step process. Step one, configure the settings. After Demo Creator's installation, launch the program and then click Start a Record Project in the next window to begin the process. Now you can see some settings that you can configure according to your needs. The Capture Area section is the most important in this sense, as it will allow you to choose if you want to record the whole screen or a select area. You can select full screen to ensure everything in the streaming is being recorded. The System Audio section is also important if you want to capture the sound of the streaming video that you want to record. If you would like to add your own voice to the recording, you can enable the Microphone option and select the microphone of your choice from the drop-down menu. The Webcam tab allows you to choose whether or not you want to capture webcam footage. Step 2. Start the recording. Now that all of your settings are set, click that record button to start recording. A 3 second countdown appears on the screen before the actual recording begins. During the recording, you can press the F9 key on your keyboard to pause or resume the recording as required. And when you're done with the recording, press the F10 key to finish the recording. Step 3. Export or edit the videos. When you finish the recording, then it will automatically switch to the video editor panel. You can preview your recording in the preview window before exporting. And you can also easily edit the recorded videos if necessary. So you could see how easy it is to record streaming videos on Windows 10 with Demo Creator. But our next method is to capture streaming videos with VLC Media Player. So I assume that nearly every single one of us, nearly every single one of us uses VLC Media Player and you've got it installed on your computer. It's also an excellent option if you're wondering how to record streaming videos on Windows 10. I'm gonna show you a few steps that you can follow to record streaming videos this way. Step one, the first step is to launch the VLC Media Player and then select Convert or Save from the Media tab. You can also press Control R on the keyboard. Step two, now go to the Capture Device tab and select Desktop in the Capture Mode drop-down menu. Step 3, you can also choose the frame rate of your choice. Generally, 10fs is suitable for recording streaming videos. Step 4, now click on the Convert or Save button at the bottom. Step 5, in the next window, click Browser to select a location to save the file and set a file name. Click the Save button after naming and selecting the file location. Step 6. At this point, you can click the Start button to start the recording. You can access the recording in the pre-selected path. There's another recording method that comes pre-built in Windows 10, which is available in the Game Bar. Windows 10 Game Bar has a screen recording feature that is primarily used for recording gameplays. However, you can use it to record streaming videos on Windows 10. It is easily accessible, it's free and easy to use. All you need to do is follow the next few steps that I'm going to show. Step 1. First of all, open the streaming video or media that you want to record. Step 2. Now launch the game bar using Windows key plus G on your keyboard. This might not work because game bar isn't enabled on your computer. And in that case, search for the game bar settings and open it. Turn on the switch next to enable Xbox game bar. And the next time you'll be able to launch it directly using that Windows G shortcut key. 
Step three, you'll see this interface on your screen where some recording tools are on the left in this window labeled capture. Step four, you can click the white circle icon to start the recording. It will capture your system audio while you can add your audio by enabling the microphone option. Step five, once you're done, click on this stop icon to stop the recording and you can find the video file in the default save location. That's all for today's video. If you found this video helpful, make sure you give it a like and subscribe to our channel for more great content. And you're welcome to comment below and write any other efficient and professional method that can be used to record streaming videos on Windows 10. Make sure to press the bell icon so you can receive notifications from our new videos. And thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next one.